So if you're like me and you're not that big on grinding for the great one of the species because, well, if you're like me, I like to run around, I like to check a lot of maps, lots of species. I, I just like the variety the game gives me. The grinding gets kind of tedious and it, it doesn't excite me that much. However, on this map, I have found it to be a little bit different so far and it's kind of got me excited to do it. I typically will set up a run for each of the species on one map. And what I do is I one night a week in the on the weeknight after work I go through and do a run of each species. I go through the run one time and then I move on. Sometimes I'll do it twice a week, but it's it's something I I, I give it time but not that much obviously. I, I can't sit and grind. I got on New Zealand because I used to do the red deer on Quattro and it you know it took a long time. New Zealand was at night and didn't want to mess with that. Well now that they're in the daytime it is raining red deer in New Zealand. I went around and set up this run and I cannot believe how easy they are to see and how many they are together. How densely packed in they are in certain spots. And two lakes for sure and this spot's a really good spot too I haven't seen very many people at this spot as you look here we're on the river toward the middle and right across here I've got another tent so I can jump right over there and I have this tent here and we're in this tree stand and we're super high up off this cliff and we're able to look down over there and see them which we will in a second but if you want a quick shot of what I'm what I do I hit this lake here in the top left it's it's it can be loaded then I hit this little spot here you have to run out here and get them to spawn in. We'll show you that in a second, probably. And then we got this nice big lake and this lake here. All those drink zones around here. I spawn in here. I shoot the ones across. I work my way around. These all spawn in. Then I can shoot them from the other side. And then this, these zones here. Then these two lakes, the two probably best lakes on my map, at least for me. And I'm probably going to put a good bet it is for you, too. We have a lot of males in these two lakes, and I have had a lot of success in the only the two runs I've done. I've done two runs since I set up, and I've got a diamond each time and a rare. We got a piebald, which we'll add those at the end of the video, just so you can kind of see those. And then I head over to this tent, and I hit the and I hit the river here, and I hit this spot, and I can get this spot, and then I jump up here, and I get this spot. Sometimes I had one over here but it's since disappeared. They probably moved to here. Then I move over to here, take these, and then there's this lake. I used to have them at this lake, but they're not anymore. There's nothing there for me. But I hit this lake, a lot of zones around it, with the four, but there are a lot of deer in those. And then I got a couple over here. That That's how I end. And I had just ended the last time. So that's the typical run I do, but this little zone here, if you if you didn't know about it, you might want to go check it out. It's a great little area to be able to see. It is really wide open to see. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six over here on the right hand side. Then we've got seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 14 males in those two drink zones. 14, wide open, easy shots, and when they run off, you, you can pluck them off all day long. Just try to leave your females and they should all come back if you don't get them all, or unless you're doing the uh, uh, management system, you're not taking those small ones anyway, but whichever way you do it, I'm sure it'll be really useful for you. So definitely check this spot if you haven't checked that. It's kind of a hidden away, it's a long way from anywhere. That's why I have them using the two tents. There's definitely one piece of advice I'll give you. The New Zealand is having crashing issues every now and then, so if you take a diamond or a rare, get down and hustle and get it. You don't want to be shooting a whole bunch of them by the time you get down, your game crashes and you never got a chance to pick it up. All I can tell you to, to fix that is make sure you're backing up your game data. And if you, if you stay on top of that, it might not hurt so bad. But now we'll go ahead and we'll take off on our map and we'll hit, we'll go through our zones, see if we can find anything. You're not going to hit all of them with you, but I'm going to show you our heaviest zones, especially these two lakes. I'll give you a good idea of what we've got going on over there. So I hope you all enjoy the video. If you do and haven't done so yet, please consider subscribing. Let's get to it. And at our first spot, we come up to that big lake in the top left corner of the map. And you can see we have a herd down there. 
That's decent. What is that? Nope. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, that this is my third time through, and if that were a diamond, that could be my third one in a row as far as run. It's my third r run. I, first two runs after I located their spots. I uh, had a diamond from each. Now that guy looks like he's going to troll us. So, And over here we have a spot and then we should have one over there. Let's see about getting this guy but he's facing us. Really bad angle. Let's see if we can't get closer I guess. Get over here. Maybe we get a angle on him. We spooked him coming in so maybe we can sit here and wait on him and get back. Possibly. There he is. Come on you little troll. <laughs> Let's walk right up here and give us a bung. Stop backwards. <laughs> We're in a horrible spot with a female. Alright. Give us a heart. Oh, that'll work. Did we get that lucky? I can't. There's no way. Oh, <laughs> 251.5. He was at the top of his range, wasn't he? Oh, what? <laughs> this, okay, it's my third time through, and I've got a diamond each time. I'm telling you, this this is crazy. This is a lot of fun. I do find myself going, hey, go go check the red deer. Go check the red deer. Oh, they something's happened, and it's definitely different here. It's so enjoyable, but. You'll have to check for yourself. <laughs> but trust me, my map and the ones that I've seen so far, people have been really enjoying New Zealand and the Red Deer. And then after our, we get done with that top corner, I go to this little lake here. I have a spot to the right, come out of the outpost, and once you run up here, and the farther back you run, the more of them will spawn in. I was only seeing one or two, and I wasn't destroying the zone, so then I ran back even further and I realized why I wasn't letting them all spawn in. Let's see if any of them are there. Hey, there's nothing there yet. And once we start getting 250, you'll start seeing them. There they come. Dropping in. And mating calls. So I try to get back pretty good ways. There's a lot of males there. I was only shooting one and two one time then I realized I wasn't going all the way back far enough so that is another zone you can potentially have a lot of males at and we're coming up on the lake that I've had so many these two are probably my two favorite of the lakes and this one up here is just loaded with males usually we should be spooking one out right here in the front I get I usually can't get past him, so I'm, that's what I'm talking about, having to set up a little different. It's like there's another one here. Yeah, there's usually two, so that's good. So keep those two in mind. Oh, there's a third one. Oh, nice big seven. All right, so there's three down here in the bottom. Try not to double count them when they run around. down here to our tripod and this tripod's fine if I were to not be so close but I can't take them all so I've got to do a tent so that I can keep some from spawning in all right we'll start here to our right we already knew about this guy we'll just count it because we'll probably have to yeah they're all busting so it looks like there was four of them 
So there's four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, way up there. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Look at that rare. Seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. There's four there. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we got a rare in there. Look at that. Wow. A diamond and a rare on this run alone. Oh, and another. What was I on? Is that nineteen? Oh, I lost track. The rare messed me up. Did you get my point? We'll say 19, I think. Tw that's a nervous one, right? Nope, 20. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. This one, the nervous ones, yep. All right, good. 25 stags on this flake alone. Are you kidding? I think if you put a tent here or here, these won't spawn in whichever end you have your tent in you'll be able to shoot across take those out switch sides and then these will spawn in you'll be able to get a few more so you'll need a tripod on both ends and a tent on at least one end that's just a suggestion but we want that guy right there for now while I have you all here we want to put him in our in our lodge there we go we got a nice drop we'll go pick him up real quick get it picked up before it crashes on us and there we go nice little pie ball to add to the collection look how good they look in them new screens aren't they beautiful that red really pops now against that white all right let's go check our other big lake now where we spawn in right here these guys actually were already there so hopefully they didn't spook from nope they didn't look at all them so the group that is over here will have not spawned in we'll have to get across the way to see them and i don't think i have anything right here i haven't i had one one time but it hasn't come back it might be now but let's get up here and see what we can count These guys haven't spawned in. Oh, what was that? So some of them have. Anyway. Ooh, yes, nice. Extra. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, I think that's all females, so there's twenty. Try to run far enough away to get them to spawn in, see what we got. All females in that group. So there's at least two there. Three, four, 24. We had, I think it was 25, right? Well, it's 24 or 25, depending on where my count was. It might be, irregardless, 24 over here. So. 50 stags between these two lakes at the current time for me. 50 stags. You could just do your grind on those two lakes once you find all your zones if you wanted to. But again, I you get through them so quick, I enjoy just going through the whole run 
With that being said, we're going to add on the first two diamonds and the rare we got from our first two runs through here on New Zealand on the Red Deer. So if you enjoyed the video, please subscribe to stay notified. If you didn't, thank you for watching this long. I'm going to have to get down here and get these two guys on the steep cliff. I'm not sure that's going to work out too well, but yeah. Back to work on the next video after that. Until then.